Hey Ravens, welcome to the very first ever edition of Raven Roundup. I'm Nick Lopez alongside August Berthold. Last Friday, the football team headed down to Leavenworth. Andrew Dumas and company put a smackdown on Leavenworth with a final score of 48 to seven. Jack Parks got it going early with a pick six touchdown. That was big. The defense will have their work cut out for them this Thursday against the undefeated Lawrence Free State Firebirds. Thursday is also senior night, so emotions will be running very high. The Ravens have been on quite the roll lately, winning its last two games against Shawnee Mission North and Leavenworth by a combined score of 89-21. to The Firebirds will look to continue their dominance and trying to improve on their 5-0 start. The dominant Firebirds have outscored their opponents 206-37 to this year, some outstanding numbers. Now the Sunflower League standings. The Ravens are in fifth place right now after a slow start falling to 0-3. The Ravens have turned it around, though. Lawrence Free State, Shawnee Mission East, and Olathe East, and Lawrence round out the top four spots with Shawnee Mission North and Shawnee Mission West being dead last. If the season were to end today, the Ravens would be taking on crosstown rival Olathe East Hawks. The Lady Ravens volleyball team took flight against Shawnee Mission South Monday night. It was senior night for the girls. Rachel Zink, Jaden Chase, Taylor Cooper, and Georgia Mullins were all honored. Coach Length looked for his 201st win after getting his 200th in the Ottawa Invitational. The girls won the match in three sets with Lindsey Heller and Cooper leading the charge on senior night. Come out this Thursday to support Northwest uh, against Shawnee Mission East and Lawrence on, at ONW as they continue the road to state. Thank you for all your hard work and dedication in bringing a state title last year to ONW. Thank you for watching Raven Roundup. See you Friday.